What up YouTube, Topaz Yates back for another review and this one is to that Lil Wayne Hercules and I'ma give it the yellow light man because it's rather reminiscent of a Millie from back in the day you dig like it's heavy lyricism on top of simplistic production where it worked out for a Millie back in them days man because it overtly became super catchy but yet music has changed from then and there's no telling how long ago Lil Wayne made this song or anything like that you did but in this case man this production simply isn't for me I honestly don't believe it'll ever become catchy because it seems though no music that Lil Wayne has been releasing is getting any kind of promotional push because of whatever he got going on legally with Bald Man and all of this stuff. So overall as a song it's not that great but yet do not sleep on the punchlines being spit here because he definitely did come through with that as we'll touch on a few of these joints man how he's saying I be so faded who washed the colors with the bleach like that was pretty cool because he's comparing the word faded like faded as in being high and faded as in clothes that have been washed with bleach and all of the colors been dried out like that was pretty cool how he said that he needs Benadryl for his trigger finger now that was maybe my favorite punchline of this entire track right here you dig because Benadryl is the pill that you take for when you have an allergic reaction in which most people get super itchy and such whenever they're having an allergic reaction and he's saying that his trigger finger is itchy. How he said that he's rolling up the weed sticky fingers like Onyx in which Sticky Fingers is a member of Onyx from back in the day and then completes the ball saying that he's throwing up gang signs and you can see it in his vomit as in throwing up as in throwing up gang signs with your hands and then throwing up like vomiting you dig like solid wordplay. Now there's not a ton of great lyricism here but the brief jewels that he drops and such it makes the song all the more worthwhile to listen to it numerous times to break it all down. And this is another great example of being in the rap game man once you gain the notoriety you can monetize anything because this song came out overtly with a compilation of skating that Lil Wayne dropped on his YouTube videos and such man in which you can make money off of all of this like it gains the notoriety of a new song and then you can go ahead and get paid for click off of that as well and this is the way that life not only the music industry works you dig because see most people think once you get put on to a record label then record label is going to pay you to do your music but that's not the game. The game is to gather enough notoriety that people come to you to pay you to do certain things in which record labels only come to you because you've already gained this notoriety. Have you guys seen the latest episode of Atlanta? I'm not going to spoil anything about it today but the very beginning of it was interesting where these chicks are getting together to go out and have fun out on the town but yet there's one chick in particular that's on her phone pretty much trying to showcase all of her friends and the makeup and everything that she got while I do believe that snapchat or instagram or something that she's on so she's live streaming her and her friends and all of that man pretty much saying if you want this lipstick then you can go to this website put in this promo code and you go ahead and get fly like me and that's probably because she got notoriety and that's how they get paid that's how they stretch that notoriety into money because you get money based off of the coupon codes and the sales that happen because of it but overall man this track was pretty decent man really the only draw here is the lyricism and the lyricism makes it worthwhile for multiple listens so definitely go ahead and peek this one on out. I hope you enjoyed the show. You can follow me at Twitter up there and you can go to downloadpads.com that's down there to read today's article.